PSG when Fitzroy find their touch that they have at the moment. They look tremendous. Five marks to Bernie Quinlan. He's got a, a long way to run in to uh, kick towards the player of the mark, but it's a big kick towards goal. But oh, he's put it through. Three goals to Bernie Quinlan. So the lead changing hands for the third time in the last three or four minutes. And now the Saints will try and win it back through Packham up to Crow. Osborne first onto the ball. Darrell Cunningham in hot pursuit. Now he's got it. Well played. Man. Brown and Pert. Brown wins the free kick. Got great position with the body. Too wrapped. I felt from the opening bounce that things haven't really gone their way. The men in white. But, uh, that one looked valid enough. Brown only 15 metres out, directly in front. Kicked a goal earlier this quarter. That's his second. The Saints grab the lead back. It's a real game at the junction over. Late in the second quarter, 24 minutes gone, and a three-point lead to St Kilda over Fitzroy. Logan getting it down towards Coleman, out towards Ruse on the centre wing. Jeff Cunningham chipping in, and the ball coming out for Packham. Packham now kicked down towards Crow. Crow uh, with Laurie knocking it away from him. Laurie following it up. Clayton's there to lend a hand. Crow comes in from behind, but uh, Clayton taking it over the line. It's on St Kilda's half-forward flank. Fine quarter of football, the Saints have kicked five goals, Fitzroy have kicked nine. It'll be a long quarter to May. Well tackled, brought down by Ruse, but after a good clean tackle, Ruse then fell into his back. And that's why Tomei gets the free kick. He's between the wing and the half forward line. Towards Allen's side bottom, much too big for Carlson. He runs on, he can have a go at them. And he's kicked it. Allen side bottom doing well, but it goes to the wrong rover. Hit Wilson. Wilson getting it out to Lee Carlson. Fitzroy now coming into attack. Across towards the half forward line. And there's the man again, Bernie Quinlan. Has already got three goals to his name in the match. A chance to kick another one. He's certainly within range for him. Super boot having kicked number eight. Big kick. And he's put it through. And Bernie Quinlan with four goals on the board. Sixteen goals kicked in 27 minutes for the quarter. Hodges puts the Saints back into attack. Open territory out on that flank. Clayton got there in time but then took it over. Rock deal on the St Kilda half forward line. But no one getting it decisively. Not able to get rid of it, that was metal pole, and it'll be another bounce. It's a Kilda's attacking zone, a three point advantage to them. Big Crow, not a good knock, and it comes to Tomei, who kicks it down the field. And uh, St Kilda putting the pressure on again. Meehan getting a hand pass out, but uh, well taken here by Grant Laurie. Laurie getting it to Lee Carlson, Carlson across to Clayton, and Fitzroy coming out of the half back line and down to their attacking half. Alan Sidewalk doing well. He's out right for this occasion by Paul Rules. Not paid. Not paid. Umpire Nash ruling that side bottom had the first hands on the ball. 28 minutes gone. Now a chance for Fitzroy to attack again. Nettle fold into half forward. Cowie in good position against Quinlan. Meehan couldn't take the ball. Knocked on by Tomei. Quinlan. Harris. He's kicked two goals for the quarter. And he's only 25 metres out. Should kick his third. Eight kicks. And this must be one of the highest scoring quarters of footy of the season. The Lions going for their 11th goal. Total of 
17 for the turn. 29 minutes gone in the second quarter. Fitzroy leading St Kilda by three points.